recording. But the reason I made this video is started with an uncomfortable, uncomfortable notion that while the King Trail covers continues day and night, and that's why my voice sounds like this. And sometimes I'm attending news about the currency reset. I remember about, I think, 10 years ago, I asked Sheldon Idol, I asked Sheldon Idol, what would it be with the King Trail? And he said it wants to reset happen, the King Trail, it stopped. The reset has not happened. The king trail is not stopped. Now, the thing that may be bothering me is about the global currency reset. The system is pretty well established, convincing in many ways, reasonable, logical, spiritually intact. However, they do not talk about human issues. They never talk about Kim failed. They never talk about child abuse. They never talk about, they, they're only thing that they talk about is the wars that they have in space or in different underground bases. And they want us to, or at least they want me to believe that they work for humanitarian reasons. But I don't find any humanitarian side in them. I have to imagine it. They depend on me supporting them for my humanitarian aspects, but they don't have humanitarian society. The reports are mechanical. The reading of the voices is mechanical. It's all machine operation that I see, and they depend on machines and on the system. So let me tell you a side story. And this may be try to make 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 the reset something more humane. I said about eight years ago or something. I contacted and was accepted into the Swiss Hindu organization I was posted in the what they call the head of the 300 bank uh, headquarters that's why I called it it was a ridiculous meaning meeting it wasn't ridiculous maybe but I didn't see any banking in there any sign of understanding in banking I didn't hear any talks about this issue of reset that sound accurate at all. And they held those meeting, this is the Swiss Indo group. They held this meeting on Skype and I was attending those meetings for a few months. And uh, at the time I was thinking about the operation on this, this uh, I call it uh, circulation the distribution of funds and I looked at the system of the banking and I could imagine that the system of the banking cannot change. I mean, you cannot convince an elephant to behave like a donkey, even if you 
dot machine tricks. So my solution for the for this machine do, when I wrote him a letter, I asked my um, public accountant, to a friend of mine and a good friend of mine, and also a collector of my art. And I'm stuck on this road very much because of the value of my art. That I cannot avoid the value of, the, of my art because I do goodness well. I cannot just do my work and leave it on the side because it would be taken by somebody and handled for me. So I had to, and there's a responsibility, of course, to any valuable art. I will, I will attend it, I will keep it. I will store it, I will show it, show it, I will promote it, even if it's not my art. In fact, my whole involvement in art is because I found artists that I loved so much that I decided to join this club. So working together with other artists, interacting with them, going to meet them, exchanging the materials, discussing things, collecting impressions from others, uh, working uh, like a conversation, imagery a conversation between artists is very common from the old days until now. Art was always a good art, it was always in the field of one. It was serving the one, and learning from one, and working together to make more beautiful and more meaningful things. Anyway, I'm banned. I'm banned on YouTube. You will see that this video has only one view. It is because YouTube denies the counting on my account. They will look at this account, they will look at this video, they know exactly who is talking. Because so they're dealing with me for years. They did, they closed my Yosan Pedro account for no reason. And they said that I was crossing the community guidelines or that I was using other materials or right protected materials. Do you hear me talking, taking any right, right, full, right protected materials in my talk? I mean, I can show you so many examples eventually. There is a concept, a category for me to be denied. It's not only the you know. <coughs> it's not only that, but the king crown that you have here. <coughs> For the most part, they are following me. So instead of having a, a spine to tell me where is where where, where are those awakened people? Where are those more intelligent people? We must shut them up. We want to not allow them to be exposed to find the public. We want to, to limit them. So what the easiest way is to find me, limit me. You don't need a spy, I'm, I'm, I'm their agent because they're following me and they're recording me and they know everything that I say. So they know my qualities and what they want to deny. Not only they want to deny, they want to rub off me off my, my work. That is, you can see with every call famous artist, how did this artist become famous? is the, those who robbed them of their work made them famous eventually. So you can see my, my position and why I'm fighting to be released, to be redeemed of this hellish uh, situation. And they still ban me everywhere if I go to comment on YouTube in places that my commenting would be meaningful, would be contributed to the understanding of this matter or I mean, I'm denied of contributing to the matter because my my commenting is denied. Sometimes I feel a personal uh, denial that is a person that
that is person or machine that is following me constantly would, would come and not allow me to, to participate. This has been going for such a long time, and I had many friends who also knew about it and didn't stand a chance of arriving to a possible moment of redemption, not on this plane anyway. And if it's not on this plane, then it's not worth it for them. Imagine an artist like my friend uh, Alexander Puto, Alexander Puto, he, 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 and, uh, he left all his work with his wife and children. It's north of France after traveling the world and trying to at least make a living, make a living of his art, which he couldn't. He really say it's big pain for me now to know his children and to know the abundance of artwork, great artworks that Alexander Puto left behind. And, and it's not properly attended, not properly shown, not properly viewed, because the viewers, they the quality of viewers are not around. They're not appreciated. They are banned. And it's true in every field that is the, the attendees of the higher quality, the higher abilities are denied. The, the cabal who are following me as well as others, and they manipulate my life, manipulate my art attack me personally, those, they don't have the capacity to capture and to work in higher dimensions, but they have the capacity to know who and how to link those who can. Yeah, so thank you for watching. I'm your son, Ben, or Joseph Tony. I don't go by any name really, but this is the names that I use. So thank you for watching.